Hello, culture, media, and education class. Uh, this is Kyle. There was a request that I make a little demo for how to use MediaThread, so that's what this is. Okay, everybody, so here I am in our uh, class Canvas page, and I'm going to scroll down on the left side uh, to find MediaThread. I'm going to click on MediaThread, and that's going to ask me if I want to launch that program in a new tab. So I'll go ahead and say yes. Uh, so here's MediaThread. You can see I'm already logged in as myself. And if you click on this View Full Collection button, uh, it will take you right to the collection of media that is already um, added to our uh, CME class collection here. So uh, here's the piece of S-Town media that I added the other day. A couple people have already made some selections. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pause uh, the playback of this video. You can uh, create a new selection uh, by going to Selections here and clicking Create. And you'll get a bunch of uh, stuff to fill in, including, most importantly, the start time and the end time of whatever clip you want to say something about. Here's the place for the title of your selection, uh, the tag, which I mentioned in the assignment that I sent out on Monday, and then notes uh, explaining uh, the connection between the concept in your tag and the clip that you've made. So um, once you've created a clip, then uh, you may recall that the second part of the assignment was to find some new media clip that uh, you might also tag with that same concept. So something uh, related to whatever um, uh, concept of interest from our course uh, you wanted to think about. So um, if I press the back button here, and I'm now just back in that same place that you're sent to when you log into MediaThread, and there's this little link here that says Import into Collection. So if I click on that, um, I'm in Google Chrome, and unfortunately you have to be in Google Chrome in order to uh, use this tool. So if I'm in Chrome, um, I have the choice to add this Chrome extension. So I'm going to add to Chrome. It's going to open a new tab in the Chrome Web Store, showing me this extension uh, to MediaThread. I'm going to add that extension to Chrome. Uh, I look at this little icon or this logo here uh, with the M and the curly Q things on it. Um, I'm going to press add extension. And the reason I wanted to draw your attention to the logo is now up here in my extensions bar, I have a, um, a, a, a link to uh, use the media thread extension wherever I am. So um, I'm going to just go to YouTube and add a uh, random collection to or a random piece of media to our collection um, let's see so here is a recent late night with Seth Meyers uh, clip um, not certainly unrelated to the kinds of things that we uh, talk about in course in the class so if I go back to that extension thing and press this button here it's going to give me the opportunity to um, collect this piece of media. So if I press collect, it's going to ask me if I want to add this to my media thread collection, and it's going to ask me to give it a title. Um, you can go with whatever the default title is that comes up when you add that piece of media, or you can make your own. I'll go ahead and save this. Success, your item has been successfully added to your media thread collection. If I click on that, it takes me back to the collection, and you can see here's the Seth Meyers clip. I'm going to delete it, so don't be freaked out if you don't see it, but hopefully that helps you um, figure out how to uh, create a, uh, a new clip in the collection. And then uh, if you want to, you can go in and uh, tag the appropriate selection in that clip uh, with whatever concept it was that you were interested in the first place. Hope this is helpful, and uh, looking forward to seeing you next week.